Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to try and send all of these ballista at the Dark Peasant. Will he survive? We're going to find out in three, two, one, go. <music> Ladies and gentlemen, mods are now working once again in Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. And what we're going to do is we're going to test amazing modded units against the Dark Peasant. I want to see if anything that these mods can dream up can defeat such a vicious being, starting with these Celestials, who do seem to have a lot of... Hold on, they, they launched into the sky? Did they launch into the sky? And then, and then is how they die? Did they die in a firestorm? Look at the Celestials all in tight on the Dark Peasant. They're unaffected by the knockback. The knockback is not actually knocking them back, but it is killing them. It is dealing damage. And they seem to be surviving. How much HP does the Dark Peasant have? Let me just grab him and see. They did deal damage. If I got enough Celestials, there's a chance. Oh, Wonder Shot over there. Look at them go. Every time they die, they fire in a random direction. That is crazy. And there's some in the sky coming at the Dark Peasant, but he seems to be surviving. He seems to have defeated all the Celestials. Now I want to see if I just, you know, kind of like increase the number of Celestials. Let's get it up to about a hundred. There we go. 100 Celestials against the Dark Peasant. Can the Dark Peasant pull it off? Can the Celestials get close enough to deal enough damage to the Dark Peasant? He's in there. The Dark Peasant is in there somewhere, guys. Surrounded on all sides by all of these Celestials who are unaffected by the knockback. The Dark Peasant, does he have enough HP? Can he survive the onslaught of Celestials? It seems like he is. It seems like almost all the Celestials have been defeated. And the Dark Peasant is victorious. There's one little Celestial, and off he goes into the sky. <laughs> That's so insane. Now, we have the Dark Peasant in a box of Spider Mages. These guys, the ones that throw webbing, and let's see if we can maybe throw enough webbing at him, and the webbing seems to be unaffected by his block, and the spider mages have successfully captured the dark peasant. He's unable to move, unable to get close enough, and now the spider mages are just raining down. Oh no. Oh no, they are close enough. He is close enough to deal damage to each of the spider mages as they try to make it rain and it's just not working. It's just not working. But um, he's not attacking anymore. Oh, there he goes. I was like, what is going on with the dark peasant? Why isn't he attacking? You see him pulling away the web. He's just stretching the web there. Doesn't care. Moving forward. He seems to be taking his sweet time. How's his HP? Oh, nope. I'm trying to capture the dark peasant. His HP's fine. There's, there's no way. There's, there's zero way. <laughs> I've never controlled the Dark Peasant. This is insane. Little left mouse button over here. Oh, control the Dark Peasant is so cool. Now we have the Dark Peasant versus a ring of Stalingrad 4 Thors. These are not the official Thor. These are the modded Thor. I think they might be stronger than the current Thor, but they may not have the lightning strike ability. Can they even get close? Here we go. Here we go. There's a Thor coming in right here. Look at these guys. They want to get nice and close. The Dark Peasant. Yo, what? They're being knocked back in every direction. This is not happening. This is not happening. The Dark Peasant is just annihilating each and every single one of these Thors, guys. There is no chance that Thor can even get close to the Dark Peasant. It's just gross. What's happening over here? Why, why are they bundled here? You see that? Oh, there's a blue Thor. Oh, I'm sorry. I accidentally gave you a blue Thor, and he's distracting all these other Thors. Look at the Thor spike. I love that ground pound ability. It's really good. My goodness. And this is our peasant here. Let me take control of him. Not even touched. Not even affected. Not even affected. There's the Thor right there. Let me just launch a nice little volley. Beautiful. And maybe... Oh, is there a blue bird about over here? Who's left alive? Oh, right here. Right here. Right here. Hey guys. How you doing? <laughs> and the hand has killed that one. Oh, the Dark Peasant is so powerful. Here is an interesting fight. The Super Archer 20. 20 Super Archers. Do you guys remember what they do? Do you remember the madness that these Super Archers accomplish? Let's see what happens when the arrows hits. Um, are they going to fire? There they go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, 
Oh, they're being stopped by the hands. You can see them right here. The arrows are being stopped by the dark hands of God. And now, no, nothing. They're stops. He doesn't care. He just stops them. And the effect of the super arrows never occurs. Guys, they cannot even get close to the dark peasant. This is so unfair. All right, we're going to step it up a notch. Maybe the dark archers can do something about this lovely dark peasant who has longer range. Here's all the, all the black holes around the dark peasant. Let's see what happens. He's dragged into them. But is he taking enough damage? Now he's, he's stuck. The dark peasant seems to be trapped. And amongst all of these range attacks, is he taking any damage? A little bit. Just a tiny, tiny little bit, guys. It's not enough. It's not enough. Guys, the dark peasant is just wiping out all of these dark archers. Oh my god, that's insane. I highly doubt this is going to work. I highly doubt the Ignis Slashers are even going to stand a chance. They're getting close. So here comes a knockback. Yeah, no. They, the melee units, they can't even get close, guys. This dark peasant is just insane. The dark peasant is just insane. Now, there is one thing. I'd like to ask, guys. Okay. I'm just going to take that peasant. And I'm just going to put some bars over here, and some bars over here, and just some bars over here. They're there as distraction. Okay. Because what we're going to do is we're going to see if we can use God powers on the Dark Peasant to defeat him. What is actually able to be used on the Dark Peasant? DLC bugs. Enable debug tools. Turn that on. Let me see. First, I'm going to try and grab the. the grab. Grab. Pause time. Grab. Grab. Is that grab? Grab, oh, 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 okay, I've got him by the hand. Can we pull the Dark Peasant away? No, he is immune to the hand of God, guys. The hand of God cannot move him. Okay, invert gravity. Okay, okay, you can be affected by gravity, that's cool. Okay, how about a vacuum? Can I use him with a vacuum? He's ignoring the vacuum. Guys, he's just walking away. He's walking away from the vacuum. It's slowing him down, but he walked away from it. How about the push ability? Can I use the wind? I can kind of keep him at bay, but he's actually slowly overpowering the wind too. Are you kidding me? And now, using my god powers, will he simply ignore all of these arrows by spawn them in a ring around him? Slow-mo. Yep, look at the hands of god, the dark hands of god. Are you kidding me? What if, oh, 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 oh. Some of the arrows have made it in, so what if I spawn them really close like within his actual sphere of influence what if i do something like that okay okay it's working how much hp oh he has a lot of hp he has a lot of hp let's switch to let's switch to the ballista let's start with the ring of ballistas around him on the outside we know what's gonna happen it's gonna be gross it's just it's gonna stop he's gonna get stopped it's just disgusting here we go slow mo so some of the ballistas stopped on the outside. Some made it through and were stopped again. There's multiple rings. Oh, okay. I, I got to try something really hardcore. Hold on a second, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to try and send all of these ballista at the Dark Peasant. Will he survive? We're going to find out in three, two, one, go. Slow-mo. Look at that. Oh my God. Look at all the dark hands of God blocking all the ballistas in every direction from every angle that's insane oh some are about to make it right here nope they're, uh, i'm wrong they, they were literally stopped by a single hand of god no there's two there all these ballistas stopped that is insane look how gross that looks he is a porcupine of ballista and it's fine and it's fine now if we point blank the ballista bolt. We get real tight, like this, just right here. And we just go, hey, hey there, ah, uh, Mr. Uh, Dark Peasant. I have for you a great spear. Now this looks really inappropriate, guys. All right, this is really inappropriate. I'm not, this is nothing inappropriate. This is just me spawning endless supplies of ballistas so that he will for sure be impacted. There's no way he can avoid this impact because there's ballistas all along this line through him, before him, and after him. Slow mo in three two, one, maximum slow-mo. He's been impacted. Look at all these other hands being spawned, stopping the backup ballistas, but he has been impacted by all of these ballista bolts did hit him. How much HP does he have? I dealt a significant chunk of damage to him, but he's not dead. It is possible 
to kill him with god powers. It's possible. It's possible. If we're patient and we work on it, guys, we can defeat the Dark Peasant with God Powers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get about here and just little circles. Tight little circles, okay? And we're definitely going to kill the Dark Peasant with this volley. I'm going to do so many circles. I'm going to sit here. And you can see on the bottom of the screen all of the ballistas that I'm spawning. I'm just going to keep doing this for like 20 minutes and spawn thousands and thousands and thousands. Is that enough? to kill the dark peasant look at this thing <laughs> oh my god three two one go oh you did it god powers are able to defeat the dark peasant so long as you are inside of his range inside of his defenses and you spawn an obscene amount of ballistas it can be done guys